<laughs> oh my gosh, you almost died. Don't ever do that again. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I am pumped. A boy. So today I'm going to be filming a Walmart clothing haul for you guys. I love workout clothing. I really do in my heart and my soul. Um, today we're going to be doing a try on slash haul video. So I'm going to go ahead and just get right into it. Oh, you guys, I'm the type of person if I find a style of like a like a shirt that I like or like a pair of shorts, I kind of go and I buy like all the colors because I'm like, well, if I find a piece of clothing I like, I might as well go big or go home. Am I right? So I went ahead and found these, and guys, just hold the phone really fast. These are six dollars, okay? Deals on deals on deals. So it just looks like this. It's this really cute mesh little t-shirt, and I'm going to be having a try-on section of this. All right, guys, this is what the first little blue t-shirt looks like. As you guys can see, it's just super cute, and it's meshed out, and this is what the back looks like. So it's super cute and ribbed, and I think it's just so, so adorable. So this is the first shirt. Like I said, it was only $6, which is kind of a crazy, crazy amount, and I always tie it up in a little knot. Um, I got this in three different colors. Hold your horses. Hold your horses. So I went ahead and grabbed this in this really pretty light blue color. I also had it in white. So this is the next shirt that I have for you guys. This is the white one. I'm actually not a huge fan of this one, um, just because it's in a size medium instead of a small. So um, it's a little bit, and since this one is so see-through, it's a little bit... Harder, but this is what this one looks like, so it's just the white version of the blue version. Um, uh, who calls the landline anymore? So I also grabbed this in the color white, and you guessed it. I've had this one for a while. This was the first color that I actually picked up, which is just the plain black one. So this is the next one. It's just the black version. And this one is probably my favorite. Um, I really, really love these. I think they're fantastic for working out in there, like, a mesh material, so you can, like, kind of see through them, but they're not, like, super see-through, and also they're also very, they're also, also, also a fun party. They're really fun to work out in because they have a mesh, so it has holes in it, so it's nice and, like, you get the air flowing, you get everything going, you're good, you're gold. So, yeah, I went ahead and picked up all three of these. Like I said, they were only $6, which I think is a pretty good deal when it comes to stuff like that. So, next, I went ahead and picked up this tank top, which I think is so cute. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys, those are all in size small. This is also in the size small, and this is a super cute little tank top that I picked up from Walmart as well. This was $10, so a little bit more on the pricey side if you're, okay, I look like I'm deathly white, and it's because I only have concealer and mascara on, so I'm not dead, don't worry. So it just looks like this. It's a really cute tank top. As you guys can see, I've already went ahead and tied this one up. This is the tank top that I showed you guys. Like I said, I just have it all tied up right here. I think this is so cute. It has um, a built-in bra, which is really, really nice for extra support. And this is what the straps look like in the back, so I just think it's super, super cute. Flex those! What? <laughs> It's a super, super neon bright color, and the straps in the back are so, so cute. So yeah, this one was only $10, which I'm like, boy. For like a tank top that's pushing it, but when it has really cute straps on it and it has a built-in bra on it, I thought those kind of made up for it. So I'm definitely going to go back and pick up some more of these because I think they are fantastic and they fit really well and they're super cute. Okay, so next I have three pairs of compression shorts. It's really, really hard to find compression shorts that are inexpensive and they're squat proof and that look good. And these are so, so fantastic. So I have three different pairs. Um, originally, I went and I saw them. They were $10, um, which is a really good price for compression shorts. So this was the first pair that I originally picked up, which looks like this. It's kind of like this... Um, little stripey stripey print and it's got like a neon green inseam to it. Alright, so this is the first pair that I have to show with you guys. So this is the printed one and this has the um, yellow on the inside. So this is what this one looks like. I think it's super, super cute, really flattering. I'm about to drop a squat right now. <laughs> And I really, really like these. Um, these ones that I'm holding up right now, these ones are a little bit more, um, they are a little bit tighter. And I think because of the print, it makes the fabric a little bit thicker. So they ride up a little bit more. So I wouldn't necessarily recommend these for like a leg day or anything like that. Or even running just because they kind of ride up a lot. And if that's something you don't mind, then that's okay. Um, I did pick up this pair, and then I decided to go back because I was kind of like mind blown that these were actually like only $10, and so I also picked up this pair, which is just a plain black one that looks like this. So this is the second pair. As you guys can see, it's a little bit more see-through. Um, I have underwear on right now, and you can kind of see through it, um, but this is what the front looks like. They're just really cute, like black spandex, and you could definitely like roll these all the way up. 
The material I use are a little bit more like a shiny type of material, so you're definitely going to be able to see a lot more like texture through it. You guys can see that's my underwear right there, so you can definitely see a little bit more through it, but I love these. Has a little logo right there. These ones, the black ones, I actually really like. Um, they're maybe not, um, they're a little bit thinner, um, and they don't ride up a lot, so I can run in these and I don't have to like constantly be pulling them down all the time, but these ones are just the plain black ones. I actually haven't tried these ones on. I also got this pair right here, which is a gray pair with some orange on the sides. Um, these ones are a little bit different because I'm not a huge fan, I don't know why, I actually don't know why I bought these, because I'm not a huge fan of when workout companies make, um, clothing and they put like this weird like seam right here on the butt and totally like cuts the butt in half like you're supposed to put the seam right down the middle cinch it up <laughs> guys I'm so starting a workout fitness clothing line one day like that's my dream um, because I have all the tricks and the trades to make the booty look good um, anyways actually the way to make it look good is just to put in the hard work and actually have it look good lol yeah I also picked up this pair right here so I'm gonna so I'll go ahead and catch the clip of me wearing these so this is actually the third pair which is a really really pretty bright orange it's not showing up as bright as it is in real life. Um, the only thing I'm a little concerned of is the front. It kind of is like major like burnt, burnt, burnt. Um, and I think the gray definitely makes that show up a lot more. So that'd be something to be aware of is like, that's what we're dealing with. <laughs> the side is super cute. It makes the booty look good. <laughs> So as you guys can see, all of these clothing items are super, super adorable. And can we talk about the price? Like everything was under, everything was under ten dollars. Yo, yo, yo! Ballin', ballin', ballin'. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little fitness workout clothing haul for you guys with the try on. And if you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you have any other questions or comments, please feel free to leave them down below. I also just want to mention, if you're still here, if you're still watching me, I made my. What is flying outside this window? There's something like me. I also made my Snapchat public, so if you guys would like to add me on Snapchat, my username is J-O-K-O-28, so like Joko. Um, a funny story behind that username, I was actually the first person in the world to download the Snapchat app, and then I downloaded it, and I was like, nobody has this, what is this? And then I deleted it, and then it like got super popular. Anyways, um, yeah, so go ahead and like this video if you liked, if you liked it, if you, if, okay. And I will go ahead and talk to you guys all in the next video. Bye!